You are inside Fremont's Candlelighter's Ghost House as Halloween celebrations are in full swing with a cast of teenagers busy scaring people. <laughs> I heard some screaming. Who was doing all the screaming? Me. Yeah, that was me. Okay. How, was you? How was it? Scary. <laughs> it got me good. <laughs> I was very scared. Was it was pretty scary because they jump at you and they, like, you know. They, they really scream at you. Help me! Oh, my God. Even as I was walking through the ghost house, complete darkness, then this. <laughs> But you did it? Yeah. Oh, cool. <laughs> yes. I don't get scared that much. I usually go to haunted houses because I want to actually get scared because it's fun being scared, in my opinion. And for those who don't want to go into this haunted house or ghost house, as they call it, there are other things like, like caramel apples. Yes, apples that have been dipped, sprinkled, and wrapped, or there are spinning wheels with prizes. And then there's this guy who some say is haunted. I'm Keone Hutton and this. <laughs> oh, my name is Mortimer. Wow. I'm a ghost. Yep. <laughs> Welcome to the haunted house. Yes, it all comes back to the ghost house. I have a Oh my God. There is a fairy line at this ghost house though for the little ones or big ones who just don't like being scared. Good fairy, good fairy, don't be scary. But for TV purposes, we have to end with a bang, or scary face, or vortex, or just a good yell. <laughs> In Fremont, J.R. Stone, <laughs> ABC7 News. Ah! <laughs>